uh, hit him out of that. And it's, it's hard in the moment to kind of either parry or shield it and then hit him. But uh, yeah, it's really good. Something, to keep, something to keep an eye on in this set too. Mars is, or, uh, light sleeves are already rolled all the way up, so power levels are already high. Yeah, that's as high as it goes, actually. Actually, there's one way to power him up. Actually, no, it just powers me up. Anyway, Old Town Road, here we go. <laughs> it's, it's starting off early, I hate baby. You. It's starting off early, baby. I hate you. Here we go. Yeah, st I mean, pretty even start back and forth. A little bit of, you know, a little bit of chicanery here in the initial start of doubles. We're going to see Naira t start taking advantage of ZS. It's a little bit off stage here. But immediately turning the tables. That's really just great play from Light to, or excuse me, Mars so far. Yeah, about even in percentages here. I mean, no one really having a, a huge advantage. Kind of switching teammate or switching who they're fighting here. Good conversion there, though. I'm telling you, like little conversions like that add up so much over the course of a set. And Wizzy's so good there too. But spot dodging immediately, knowing when Nairo is about to pull off that up smash. Not often have these two guys teamed together. I believe this might be the first time, but obviously the double specialist in Dark Wizzy. Yeah, so strong. He's so good at doubles, dude. And Mario has always been a good doubles character since Smash 4, I guess I should say. I was like, uh, you know, always like, you know, Smash 4 and Dark Wizzy. Oh, jeez. All right, we're in there. <laughs> Try for the up smash. Nairo, I don't know if it was a misimport or trying to read a roll on the other side, but either way, that back air, doinking Mars off the first side with the retaliation up smash. Light right? just running sick. down Palu across stage. Super sick. The benefit of playing one of the fastest ground speed characters in the game. It's funny. Fox can just run you down. It's funny because, like, on paper, you think uh, Fox would be, like, an amazing doubles character. And I do think he's good. Like, don't get me wrong, but it's I really think, like, it really comes down to his recovery being very exploitable. Like, losing stocks early is one of the worst character yeah, traits it's you can the, have. Yeah, uh, it's the Italian concept of Fragile, a uh, very, very soft character. But I, I really like Wizzy's play so far. He really has been the stock tank Ooh. in a midway character, really just keeping things alive for, so far for Nairo. And finally losing it there, of course, but it was the only person with their first stock for a very long time. Nice, good convert. I'm telling you, man, like seriously, those little conversions add up. Oh my god, it's, that was. It's a cross beautiful, stage. Beautiful. It's that a cross crazy. stage. And like we said, like the back throw, not only great for setting it up, getting some charge on that up smash, but also defending himself. You know, from Light, who is on his way in to try to break up that action. That's the second stock he's taken from Light, which is to charge Mario up smash. It's so, so good. And it's like, and it, it's pretty seriously nerfed from for an ultimate. Much smaller, a lot less knockback on it, but still using it to its full effect. Right. Yeah, that's the thing with Mario. Like, he's he's got he's such a good doubles character. Like you said, he's kind of tanking, even though he's not the heaviest ever. The thing is, he's so quick, and he has such good frame data, both in the air and on the ground. I love the use of that up B there. It's a really good combo ender. Uh, obviously, in doubles, you can't go as long with your combos, but it lasts so long and hits stun that Naira is actually able to play off it almost every time. Look at that recognition from Naira hopping right down and getting the up smash off the back throw. Mars even tried to break up the action with a Nair, too, and couldn't do it. I think at that point, the thing you got to do is just run up and dash attack and hit your teammate a little bit. Yep. Three light stocks, three up smashes, and Dark Wizzy all over him. That, of course, was off of the grab there, but this is looking really rough right now. Winner of this going to be taking home a big $60, so. <laughs> yeah, you know, maybe nerves are coming into play a little bit here. <laughs> oh god, explosive flame at the ledge. That's gonna do it. See, Dark Wizzy try to finish it off with the up B as well. Not nice. not satisfied enough in knowing that that was already gonna take the stock. Had to get a little bit extra on there, just a little bit of oomph. Just showing the awareness, man. And it's always good to work like go for stuff like that, like in mo because. I don't know, that might add up somewhere later in the set, you know, like where you need to end up be out of explosive flame. Like, just be aware and be ready for that. Do you think if we yell loud enough, he'll go Ganon? Which, which one of them? Not Light right. Light might. He's not. Nah, I don't know. They look kind of serious, honestly, which is weird. I don't know why. Oh. See, I like the first one better. Than this one? This is, yeah. Was this Xenia right? I like the. Uh, this is. Uh, the Soul Galeo uh, one is really good, and so is the uh, Elite Four. The Elite Four is the best. That's mm -hmm. actually just the best song. But it's getting overplayed. Better than, better than Old Town Road? <laughs> well, best song in Smash. Right? Ah, gotcha, gotcha. When When Billy Ray Cyrus has released his DLC, he gets his own stage with a horse on it, and that song's in there, it's over, dude. Well, he's going to have Old Town Road and Achy Breaky Heart for all the, for all the old school, That's before true. he was famous, Billy, Billy Ray Cyrus fans out there. Anyway. Getting it started on Kalos. I actually love this stage. This is probably my favorite stage that we've added to the competitive rule set in uh, Ultimate going from Smash 4. I love this stage. I think it's very great. It's unique. It's big. It's got walls. It's cool. You have a lot of room to play on this, too. For sure. Which, of course, you, I mean, we've seen the conversions earlier with the, the Palo of Smash. Right. The size of the stage doesn't matter. They'll pick it up from wherever. Yeah, we're also going to see Mars making the switch over to Ike, too. Interesting. I feel like, like, the thing about Mars is that he loves the walls of Zero Suit. Oh, my. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Up smash, yeah, yeah, why not? Yep, scooping. Right over the ledge. Very nice stuff by Naira. I thought he was going to go for a down air at the ledge. But Light, he respected Light's ability to recover there, because Light goes over the ledge a lot. So Naira just went for the safe up smash. Made a lot of sense. Woo! 
tons of damage being thrown at him from blue team, but they haven't just been able to get that first stock is the problem. I think White messed up there. He dashed attack Dark Wizard. I think he meant to up smash, but there he goes. He found one anyway, of course. Of course he did. He always does. We well, like getting in the way there. Did you see that? Yeah. That was amazing. I don't know if like you did that on purpose, but I'm pretty sure it pushed Mario far enough away where the up smash wouldn't connect on Mars. That was really cool. And obviously Rage not as impactful in this game as it was in 4, but with Ike sitting at 167 Ooh. right now, he's going to be doing a little bit extra knock, a little bit extra oomph. Maybe one or two hits that'll kill a little bit early on Nairo that it weren't, wouldn't have been otherwise. Nice. Oh, that's so smart by Light. So instead of going after Dark Wizzy, trying to challenge the back throw, he went after Nairo. Yeah. Like that, that is nice. He saw nice. the explosive flame. Smart. Your, your mage is casting in the background. You're going to pick her yeah. up. Yeah. It makes sense. Instead of trying to fight Mario, who's, it's tough to fight that back, air, or back throw because you don't know when he's going to do it. Yeah, and the thing is, like, if you don't time it at the right time, you might actually hit your opponent as well. Like, it's rough. It's yeah. rough going. I still think, like, running up and, like, if you have a dash attack or a tilt or something that'll just hit both of them, I think that's a good option, too. But going after Nairo is also very smart. Cool. All right, don't look now, but Blue Team actually taking a slight lead right now. Yeah, combination of the stage, and I think that Ike is working out nice, too. Just kind of changing the pacing of the matchup. We will love the empty hop into the jab there. Catching Dark Wizzy a little bit off guard. Oh, Here, the F-Throw gonna kill, though. Here's the scary thing about Ike, though. He's fighting against Mario, who is blood fully charged. And Cape. So off stage, yeah, and Cape, of course, yeah. It's just so scary for Ike to try to recover here. Especially, like, that was the recognition from Wizzy. At one point, he just kind of ran out of the action. was like, you know what, I'm gonna, char I'm gonna charge this blood. I need it. Oh, God. Oh, he rolled back, too. The, the actual chutzpah of this man. Not as brave as the up air I did against Mars, but still pretty brave. <laughs> You remember that up air? That was sick. Yeah, didn't we win on this stage? Yeah, we did. The light went Greninja. So that's, that's a big X factor. That's a big X factor. Back throw. It, oh, okay. Up smash. I like it. I feel like F tilt could have got the jab done or up tilt. All right, we're looking at pretty much dead even for sense right now. I like Dark Wizzy's positioning on that air as well. Getting the parry off of that just in case you came out the backside of him was going to be able to close out a stock there. It's blue team, yeah. Ooh. Pretty decent here, but you know, if either one of them loses a the stock, we're, we're in a very, very close situation. Back throw, not enough. Good DI from Mars. Here he comes, though. Going high, nice. Swinging a Dark Wizzy, avoiding the explosive flame. That was a perfect recovery. And now you gotta deal with Ike with some rage, like, or with a lot of rage, actually. Not good. And having these extra platforms here, you know, I think this, I think the platforms uh, layout also influenced the Ike pick as well, because you can really recover a lot of different ways with Ike on this stage. Oh, God. Mars tried to uh, Ganon Nairo with yeah. like, you know what I'm saying? Just trying to forward smash the soul read. Yeah. Duria. Uh, did not look like great. At CI. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Mars goes, okay, you got it. He let, go, he let go of the neutral beat, but it was too late. Yeah. All right, how are we going to finish? Light's going to chill in the back. Nairo's going to go for either. Nothing. He's All right. Get F -tilted, yeah. Just a Claymore to the dome. Yeah. Yeah, man, good coverage there by Mars. Gotta know how to deal with the drop up the legend uh, aerial. It's such, such a good option in this game. Not enough people, I feel like, deal with it efficiently, so. Mars did right there, though. F tilt, very good job. There's Koopa. Hey, Koopa. Right to left. There he goes. Hangman, go. too. Coast to coast. Is that Hangman? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Purple, uh, the, the purple button up. Let's go, Hangman. The lilac. Or the lilac. Lilac. He's tilted. What are you, what are you drinking? Hydrating boost. Stay, fr oh, stay fresh. Oh, it's hydrating. That's stay good. Fresh. See, this makes sense for us doing doubles and, like, the New York commentators doing the, the tri-state circuit. Because I'd yeah. be looking at the, the roster the entire time going, uh. I think we're doing that, though. All right. So All right. It'll be fun. There we go. It'll be good. It'll be good. Yeah, for those just tuning in, we got fifth and doubles. You know, no big, no big deal. Yeah, this is the song. This is the song, by the way. Yeah. This is the best song. That just that deep bass boost on the bottom. I cannot wait for Evo this year when like, oh like the music just hits for the first time and you're just like, yeah. Hell and yeah, then someone gets that pair and you're like, yeah. You know, what I was singing to you the sound effects on like when someone gets launched quickly is so satisfying. Like, oh the, yeah. Like the little. Very nice. But either way, we're going into game three here, going back uh, to stadium. Oh, I mean, wait, did we start a stadium? No, we had FDE actually was the first stage, I'm pretty sure. Oh, you saw the cape there from Dark Wizzy trying to get a little cheeky on that early kill. So that's the thing, like, Nairo's doing such a good job converting off of Wizzy's little hits, which is what you need to do when you team with Mario. Like, he, he can obviously combo. Oh, God, what is going on here? Down air. Okay, interesting choice. Light breaking up the action, though. Good choice. Nice. Nice. Uh oh. 
See, I like the I like the choice there from Light to hang on ledge rather than try to challenge Nairo off stage like that. Oh, just too low with the air dodge. Yeah, Light's recovery is he's having a tough time actually. Oh, wow. by Wizzy. Oh my God, he committed to that 100. percent That was awesome. Good trade there too, Wizzy. That was that was as as tag says S plus play. Oh, that wasn't though. No. He just got hit by the uh, the elite smash. Forward smash, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you hop on into Ike's first game, just forward smashes you, and you're like, all right, fair enough. You got it. You got it. Like, it's like I'm upset by this, but like you but, got it. It's on you. I'm like that's all I right. Deserve it. I deserve it. Oh, the double. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Yeah, man. Oh. Nairo is in fact that guy. That's true, actually. Oh, you see him angle his shield too. That's so smart. Yep. It's just the awareness, man. Like. Thing with this game, you got to do everything within your power at all moments to either defend yourself or extend your uh, advantage. You saw the Gimmer video, right? The 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 shield shuffle. Oh yeah yeah yeah, it's neat. Gimmer Gimmer's super smart. He makes very good videos. So check him out by the way. That's a VGBC's channel, I'm pretty sure. So. I don't think it's his own. But either way. Ooh, good death stick there. Just really controlling the space underneath with almost all the players above ground there. Really just oh, kept uh, Dark Wizzy from just getting back to center. Here we go, Marzo working with that 150% sweet spot. Let's see if we can find something here. I mean, trying to recover against Ike with Max Rage right there is so scary. So now we're just taking the high high route out of there. Smart. Oh my god, see how he's down airing that? Like, the fact that he can defend himself so easily is amazing. Quick draw literally going all the way across the stage. Still alive, 176. Yeah, so Dark Wizzy has to say about that and the F smash finish. Yeah, this is looking like a red team's game, man. They'd have to either... Blue team's gonna have to make it a huge, huge play, or red team's gonna have to muck up somewhere, you know what I'm saying? I was about to say, it's only a couple of tr transactions in neutral away from being even, though. That's true. You're looking Fair enough. Yeah, Nyra's already at 99%, not far away from an up smash or any of Ike's smash attacks. Or dash attack, there you go. go. Fair enough, all right, tied in terms of stocks. My bad, I didn't mean to doubt my boys right there, but uh, I did it, so there you go. You're getting to it longer, brother, I'm sorry. It's all good. Uh, for that, I'll take it. Good air dodge there. We're going to get grabbed again. It was high. Does he's, it light. he's just dash attacking. I think <laughs> his A button is broken. I think it's so funny now that you mentioned the 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 Ike or the, the Nairo Ganon effect with yeah. the Ike smashes because it's literally all of Ganon smashes are Ikes. Pretty much, yeah. Ooh, just like that, blue team brought this one back from the depths. Now we're going to have to win a 2v1. Very possible, though. I feel like in this game, 2v1s are, are more possible than they have been in the past, so we'll see. Yeah, especially with Paolo, you're going to see a lot of big hitboxes that can really just take advantage of either of these characters. I don't know, though, because, like, she wants to combo in there. If you're hitting one of them with there, the other one's behind you. Like, it's, I don't know, man. It's, it's going to be tough for, for old Nairo here. Back air to back air. Like, that was, they both showed their hand. Like, I'm back airing. All right, cool, me too, man. I'm back airing. All right, you want back air? All right, I'll back air. And Light says, I want back air. <laughs> That's it. I knew, I, knew, I knew it was going to happen. I knew it was going to be a back. <laughs> I'm upset. You know what, though? I'm Didn't upset. say nice back Are you, in, are you in the side bet, bet Discord? Because I feel like no. you should be after this. No, I don't do that. I don't, I don't. You're above that? All right, all right. No, I'm not above it. It's just, I can't, man. Can't do it. Can't do it. Nah, man. Money is flying in that. It's great. Not for me, man. I'm chilling. I've won a couple, and then I just, I just dip. All right, running it back to PS2. Obviously not a bad uh, situation in game three. The blue team just able to take advantage of a couple extra wins in neutral. I don't know about that because Light kind of died super early. Do you remember that? And they still brought it back in one. So it's kind of like, you remember that? No. I feel like that was the stage, right? No? Light died early? Oh, Maybe. Did. Maybe it was early beginning of the game. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. And I feel like they dug themselves out of a hole like pretty, pretty sufficiently. So if I'm red team, I, I would not want to come back here. And right now, blue team kind of showing that one off. Down tilt? Nice. I thought he was going to go for a back air there, but you know what? Come on now. Come on now. Oh, I like the extended nair there from Dark Wizzy. Oh, God, that was so smart. Everyone thought he was going to back air there. Instead, oh, God, double back air. Jesus, dude, I can't. I guess I'm done seeing back air for the rest of the day. It's over. This is nice back air times 8,000. Oh, gone. Mars going off right now. Huge lead right now. That's what I'm saying. Like, they, they definitely, like, Beginning of the last game, I felt like this was Dark Wizzy and Nairo stage, and now Light Mars just took it over. Like they, they planted their flag in it, like this is ours, this, this is it. Yeah, we might be in a tri-state event, but New England is going to be showing out. Yeah, for sure. 
I'd be surprised if there weren't at least two members of New England. Oh, whoop! And that's going to be the one input, so yeah. a lot cooler than it actually looks, but still. Sounds awesome. All right, there we go. See, in that yeah. situation, you either opt for 2v1 uh, against Nairo if you're Mars, or you go after Dark Wizzy for the isolation. But didn't work out. Red Sea making that one work out for them instead. Yeah, really good sequence there from Nairo. Uh, Light just nearing a little bit too close to Nairo's shield, which started that off with the back throw to finish out the, the, uh, the Fox stock, and then really just cleaned up Ike right immediately after. It's Good. been interesting. The last like 30 seconds ago, we've seen Dark Wizzy almost as a non-factor. Not really yeah. able to get back into the fray. Really good, like, not keep away play from Blue Team. Look at that. Isolation again. All right, here comes Light at the ledge with Mars covering the roll distance. Couldn't find anything, though. Good job by Nairo. Pick the right option. Sometimes it's as simple as that, you know? You gotta pick the right one. That's the scary thing about against a lot of the top tiers in Ultimate, though. Like, if you have to pick the one right option where you just die. Right. For the up air too. That's the only thing with Palu, like out of Mario's throws, her hitbox in the air is so active between up air and air, like it's just kind of easy to scoop. And up smash too, which he, he's been using a ton, so it just makes a lot of sense. The team is nice. Nice pick up there from Mar uh, from Light. Punished by Mars, getting the dash attack. They're gonna go for the 2v1 on Wizzy. Yes, great coverage by Mars, good call. Yeah, Light immediately knowing, recognizing to jump away there, seeing Mars coming in with a forward smash. Tricky situation right there. You know oh. Nairo's gonna look for the grab. Good evasion by Light. Uh, you back row, what are you kidding me? What are you waiting for? <laughs> just do it, man. He can't hit you out of it. We've yeah. seen that a million times. Mars was just, just sitting there it. looking at him, just like, all right. It's all right, dude, you got him. Man. He's like, I got your friend, I got your friend. He's what are you gonna like, do? I know. I've got a hostage. Go He's ahead. Like, I was like, okay. Go ahead. It's just Light, I don't care. <laughs> You're expendable. Like, whatever, dude, yeah. <laughs> yep. That's actually a Did huge we just, thing. we just establish the fact that Mars is the protag then? Uh, you know, Light. Light's a good protagonist too, though. They're both good. Can't complain. But I mean, Light's still alive. You know what I'm saying? Like he's, he's still there. Uh oh. A little late. Up till oh god, back here like that, man. You just gotta know. The spacing around with that down air right there too, fantastic Oop. from Light. Double up air into the air dodge. Nice shot by Wizzy. Mario definitely a good two v one character for yeah. sure. Been... Ooh. Wait. Ooh. Okay. So for their hit, I was like, one of them's going. That's it. Okay. Wow. All right. See, I will agree with you to an extent that Mario is a good two-man character, but he can't finish his combos in the same normal route, though. No. You know, in that situation, he might have been able to pick up with the rage, the up B off the top, but then just leaving himself in such a bad situation. You have to cut things short. You want to end that one with, like, a nair, you know what I mean, yeah. and then fight your way down. But, yeah, he, he has to choose different stuff, but he definitely can safely throw, which is, like, kind of a different thing. Not safely, obviously, but, like, he has the opportunity to throw, which a lot of characters don't. I don't know, he's, he's got some stuff. No and he can give, too, both these characters very easily. No thoughts of a switch. Uh, Nairo and Dark, was he going to stick with the Mario-Palo combo? Yeah. And still the Pokemon Stadium, all right. Despite was a pretty, like, as far as these games have gone, I feel like Game 3 is probably the most convincing one we've seen so far. There to grab, nice punish by Marzo, and then Wizzy punishing appropriately too. That is that Ooh. is uh, doubles 101 right there. Teammate A gets hit, teammate B saves him, teammate C comes in and cleans up the last hit. So if you win the first hit in neutral, you're coming out ahead. That's how it should work. Oh, and it, okay, Mars. And it's been crazy because neither teams have kept momentum that much either. We've seen a lot of just these straight hits turn into something. We finally see a moment where both red team can kind of just create this like this island in between them in the center stage, keeping both players, members of blue team at ledge. You see the up smash? No, a little too close actually. That was that was not the usual distance they do that setup from. Uh, so that would have been good if, if Mars was able. To, uh, I don't know if it would have KO. Probably hard to say. Nice. Okay. Go. Yep. 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 You gotta defend your teammate, man. It's so, so important in doubles. And Light doing exactly that. That's one thing that Fox really, really does have going for him. His speed and his frame data is super good. So he's able, he's able to cover Mars. Look at him run in just like that. It's the same thing. He can chill in the back and just run in at you. He, like, he covers a lot of distance, yeah. Ooh, just the tip of Ragnar. They're gonna finish that out. I love Ragnar. It's such a cool name, such a cool sword. Ike's dope. I'm a fan. We like Ike, you know? Yeah, of course. Down throw. Follow ups. Look for Wizzy to fade in, couldn't find anything, but he's gonna keep trapping the ledge. Isolation here for the blue team. Both doing work on the ledges. Nice. Good ball through, man. The up air is so much reach, dude. Yeah, no, it's crazy. It's, it seemed like the, the full length of that was so nice. 
Mars pulling the trigger on that forward smash is kind of crazy because Light, Light was a little bit like in that area, you know. He's yeah. he 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 using the right, he was in the right zip code, you know. I think Dark Wizzy actually footstooled Light as well, so that was actually almost really bad. Yeah, right. That would have sucked. Nothing, nothing will take the uh, momentum away from your team like getting forward smashed by your own Ike. There you go. Mars taking Wizzy off the top. Very good stuff. Down smash from Light. All right, still a slight lead right now for Blue Team, but not ending within the, like the realm of feeling comfortable. Okay, caught light coming in though. Definitely take that. Jab. Nice. Oh, what? oh, I like that he rolled away. He's like, you know, I'm gonna just run in and punish after the fact. That was nice. Good yeah, choice by light. Because he could have rolled through as well. Yeah. After the multi hits there. I think light has a. Or, sorry, I think box is like a short roll though. So I don't know if he could make it around that. Maybe True. though. I mean, light knows better. Well, maybe yeah. he doesn't know. I was gonna say maybe he doesn't. He might not honestly. I mean, it, it worked. It worked. Yeah, that's right, all right. He that's made all it work. No, that's, that's, that's a really good point. Yeah. It happened. Light trying to come in and save his teammate with a back air. Good job by Wizzy. Uh-oh. Beautiful pick up there. All right. All right, we're looking. Nice. Okay, good job by Wizzy. Just going, you know what? All right, I got this. Brandon got the KO. Now Light's going to have to win this 2v1. Oh, God. Imagine trying to cover, recover against Dark Wizzy while Nairo's in the back. <laughs> just explosive flaming just, out, just outside the realm. You thought it was crazy when you had horses in the back. What if oh, you got Nairo? shut what up. <laughs> what if you got Nairo in the back? You know what I'm saying? Trying to scoop right there. That, every that every time well. you apply for a gig from now on, I'm just going to show them that clip, and they're like, Please oh, do. we'll go with someone else. Please do. All right. I'll be so happy. Yeah, nice. good pick up there. Not, that doesn't send anywhere, man. That's like embarrassing. Wow, kind of. okay. I did not expect that to go all the way through the explosive flame. That was a, that was a great recovery by Light, but Nairo just kept covering everything, man. Good job. He smothered him at the ledge. That was so yeah. nice. That's like a true false question where you just bubble everything in and it works out for you. Yeah. Yeah, Nairo just checked all the right boxes basically, you know what I mean? He went down the checklist, like, right, here's gonna cover this. Light even I love that angle he went with, but the down tilt is just so active, it hits low. It just sucks. Sucks for uh, light rules rules and for it's, uh, and it's so much easier to two frame in this game, so I feel like characters with that that buff yeah. th that buff down tilt like Palutena is gonna really, really benefit from situations like that. Oh okay. yeah. I see the run back to Kalos. It's been a really good stage for them in double so far. Yeah, man, game five. Yeah, two two. Yeah, especially after you know winners finals being a three zero in the favor of uh, Mar of uh, Nairo and Darkwizzy, it really lends itself to your theory earlier about how both these character or players just needed a little bit of time to like wind themselves up a bit. I think honestly, the Ike was a big change too because usually Mars was flying around with Zero Suit, using her agility and being like kind of the initiator or first first responder, basically. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. With Ike, he's got to let Fox go in first, basically. So I think the natural tempo of these characters really helped out their teamwork, honestly. I like the wait there from Mars. We saw him just empty hop a few times, waiting for Dark Wizzy to come in and then finally committing to the Nair. Oh, he spots us right in his face and nothing happened? Okay, fine, fair enough. Sure. Sometimes you just gotta do it, man. Good mashup by Mars. You know he's mashing crazy. I don't know why Wizzy pummeled that much. And like that, they just turned it around and said, I guess, I don't know, it was on Mars, but you, you gotta take the damage from the smash right there, especially since it's Oh, it. goodbye. No, still has the jump, okay. See where he goes this time. Gets the Nair this time. This is the grab, though. That could have been a really good conversion with Dark Wizzy that far away. And that's really one of these stage benefits, too. This stage is so big, so if yeah. you knock away one of your opponents, the TV one just lasts that much longer. Not good. A little team kill there from the blue team. Tied up now in terms of stocks. Dark Wizzy doing his thing, so is Mars. Job by Light saying, get off my mans. Booting him out of there. Very nice. Ooh, okay, I love that. Nairo recognized and respect that Light was going to hit him, so instead of going for the up smash, he just jumped up and tried to back air. It's so smart. Oh, finally there. I was going to be curious to see which long-living long -living member of the either team is going to die first. It's huge, dude, because now I feel like the red team's got to make something happen here. Before, I mean, if Nairo loses this stock before Mars loses his first one, that's really bad for the red team. Grab. Forward throw? That's so hard to react to. You want the back throw, of course. Oh, nice. beautiful there. Nairo playing just outside of the range of the ether, coming in and immediately closing that out. For sure. And, you know, Mars got to feel pretty good about that stock anyway. Like, he almost janked out the stock there, too. He's going for the up B stuff, but there goes Light again. Definitely seeing a theme with this team. Uh -oh. Uh oh no, is that? Oh, yes, just, just enough. enough. Yeah, that, nice living job. Living to 200 and then living to 12. Like I said, one of the worst things you can do in doubles is lose stocks early. And Mario is so good at so many things in doubles like that. Do you see that double throw? Sick. Not many characters can get away with uh, nonsense like that.
But you can steal stocks against Ike and uh, Fox especially. Oh, that was so scary too. That was literally frames away from Mario Fair winning in that situation. Right. Oh my god. Jeez. Yeah, now that they have a stock lead, uh, they can do crazy stuff like that. Like, Wizzy can go for more uh, YOLO options just because, like, if it doesn't work out, it's not that big of a deal because he doesn't. Uh, those are great pummels, by the way. He defended himself with that pummel. All right, blue team, though, this is a big situation for them. They definitely want to take a stock now. Oh, man, just, just out of position. I thought for sure Mars would be able to, you know, up air, react, something, something, you know, but I'm surprised he didn't. But that was pretty quick, so. Oh, there goes Dark Wizzy. Okay. It's huge. Nairo's got to chill. Oh, God, that up smash coming a little close, but here we go. Mars trying to recover. Snaps to the ledge. Nairo, what's he got? Whips the back air, and he gets one in his face instead. Dark Wizzy coming in. He's got to help him out. All the stage control. Oh, Nairo's got to go oh, all the way out. What a tech from Nairo. That was amazing. And then Nairo trying to defend himself on the way up, accidentally hitting Dark Wizzy. But look at this. Look at this. Just outside of the range. What's the punish here? There goes Palu, oh, there goes and now Palu. it's a 2v1. Yep. Yeah, this is really scary now. We want, we want oh. to see the reset. Wizzy trying to make some magic happen. Trying to oh my god. There. Oh god. Uh oh. Now? Oh, okay. Good evasion by Wizzy. He had the wall jump. Smart, smart, smart. I miss it too. Mars has been late on all of his neutral beats though, so I'm not surprised you pulled the trigger a little earlier there. Oh, just outside of it. Hate to miss those because now you're still. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That worked out. Good spacing right there. Baiting the grab. That's that's the bane of Mario, man. Trying to fight against the swords. It's just so hard for him to get his uh, grubby little plumber paws on. But nice job, man. That's going to be a bracket reset. Yeah, what a fantastic play there, because after that, that nice. initial death, Mars did not flinch at all, dying yeah, at 12% no. and then holding on to that stock for so long. It's an occupational hazard if you're playing as Ike against Mario. Like, it's just, it's just you're going to lose at least one like that. Is that a plumbing like joke? What is Ike? He's a mercenary, isn't he? Like, yeah. Is he? I don't know. Let's sell, let's sell sword, I believe so. Because he's not, he's not in the, if I remember correctly, he's not in the, the military proper in, in Emblem. All right, fair enough. Yeah, it's an occupational hazard. You're a mercenary, you might die. Like, it is what it is. But it just, you know, you're going to go run it back to set two. Dark Wizzy and Nairo trying to take this one home, even though they dropped the set. Uh, but they got Light and Mars really heating up here. Wow. Picking Mars just opening with the full charge quick draw, too. He's feeling himself. That's scary. If you're a Dark Wizzy and or Nairo fan. Yeah, I was talking about this the other day with some players about, like, which top player is really influenced by momentum the most. And I feel like Mars has got to be in that conversation. Of course, Light too, man. And Nairo, honestly, all four players on the screen. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. It's scary as hell. Like, they start going for some just absolutely ridiculous stuff. Light too, I think he has some of the best parries uh, in the game right now. Second in New England only to me, which is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's top back. two. That's back, bro. Top that's two back. in a region. Yeah, top two <laughs> the, in the region. The third strike god. Yeah, that's right. Forward Ooh. smash, great trade for Light. Not enough power quite yet, though. Look at all this stage control, though. PS2 is such a giant stage, and blue team just absolutely suffocating um, Nairo and Dark Wizzy right now. Uh-oh. Okay, the back air, though. First blood going to the red team. That's going to be a big deal. Let's see what Light can do. He's going to have to try to make some action happen here. Yeah. Oh. Safe play there. Just pushing him in over to Palu. Yeah. If Nairo is able to pick it up, great. If not, you're just out of, you're out of, nice. uh, out of damage there. Wizzy got the parry on the forward tilt, ran in, got the reverse up smash. That was really good. Let's see what they can do with this. Nice, good damage on Light, but they did drop a stock for it. I'm going to say that wasn't worth it, but 34% is pretty nice. Uh-oh. Oh, 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 Mario just popped right up into that poor god. Could you imagine, like, what if the VR was on and you just saw that? You'd get popped off a ledge and Ragnall is just slicing just like, your face. just like, oh, I'm safe right oh here. Oh, my god. And then it your, was your, your, teammate. Ma your mage just teleports in and puts you right into the line of fire. It was, okay. Another thing I, we haven't seen enough of from the blue team is rapid jab into combos are so good. Yeah, and oh, and okay, bye. Fox with that frame two jab as well, you know, so I able to just set up and just hold you in place for so long. I'm surprised we haven't seen him more in the 2v1 too, because Mars likes to jump over them. And uh, uh, okay. Speaking of rapid jabs, Jesus, what yeah. a pickup there from Dark Wizzy off of Palace jab. That's so good, man. You see Cosmos do it all the time with uh, Inkling too. Oh, of course. The that thing, like, so good. You're just locked in at that point. You're it's got to like, be the best rapid jab in the game, right? It just oh, has to easily. Be. It has to be, Easily. Right? That or peek on ledge. Uh, that is really good, but it doesn't put ink on them. Oh, true, true. The passive buff. That's why I was like, it's got to it's gotta be up there at least. I thought he was going to try to back air there. Jesus it's knowing Christ. light. Uh, oh, no. Great trade for the red team, but there goes Ike tumbling into the background. See what, see what Light can do in this 2v1, though. He's, he's completely fresh stock going into this. So. Fox is a good 2v1, too. A lot of great yes. fast kill options. I agree, actually, like for sure. 
the thing he has to worry about is he, he can't get knocked onto the ledge. No, he, he absolutely cannot, not. He cannot go to the ledge. Man. And, I mean, Light's so good at target switching as well. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah, he, he whipped that one by about 600 frames. And the worst part is that was an initial jab, uh, a lock set up there, too. Nice. Good scoop up by Nairo. Great reaction. Game one. Going over to the red team. Are they red? Yeah, they're not blue. They always could be. 1-0. We had a bracket reset. What are you talking about? No, it, no it, that, was, that was game one of a bracket reset. Yeah, because it was game five. Yeah. What is going on? You can put whatever you want down. But that was definitely game one. Yeah. That, was like game that, one that is the sixth game of Grand Finals just now. Nairo and Dark Wizzy won the sixth game, the first game of the Grand Finals reset. I'm so Devin, you can put whatever you want. You're, you're the boss. Just put just put Haz and Broza down there as Dark Wizzy and Nairo. Can I be Nairo? Actually, I'll take either. I'll be the doubles god. You'll be the, the energy sponsor. Hell yeah. Uh, here we go, man. It's going to be Kalos, too. This is looking a lot like the last set, because they, they lost game one, even though it was on FD. Uh, game two went to Kalos, and the blue team took over there with uh, the Ike coming off the bench. Ooh. Devin, what's so funny? It's 2-1, set two. How? That was just game... So sure. set one was best of three. No. I'm so confused. You know what would be nice? Mr. Master G would update. Yeah. All right. All Fair right. Enough. So supposedly set one was 3 1 and not 3 2? Wow, we are way off. Hey, oh, some coffee, okay. bro. So it's 1 1. All right. Wow. 2 1. Look at it down there. Honestly, the score was hard to see. I blame the layout. Yeah, <laughs> I blame okay. the layout. Honestly, you've heard of Smash Player Johns? Have you ever heard of Smash Commentator Johns? Because you're about to get them. <laughs> Why are we up here? I don't care. <laughs> Let me say something. Please, we're having a good time. Please, get on, get on, the, get on the soapbox, baby. We're, we're having a good time. I love doubles. Here we go. Run up a Smash by Nairo here in game whatever we're in. <laughs> Nobody cares. It's for $60. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, top professional Smash player has that. That's me. Nintendo said it, dude. It's official. I don't know what to tell you. The man at the Nintendo booth said I'm a professional. I said, yeah, he's right. What am I going to do? Say no? Of course not, man. But either way. All right, so in this game four, blue team with a pretty good lead right now. <laughs> yep. Down yep. it from Mars, clearing out the stock. Good job there. Blue team. Like I said, dude, the Kalos is just a big deal. It's a good stage for them. I'm like, what the game did we miss? <laughs> like, really, though? <laughs> like, seriously, man. I was Honestly, I said it, and I was like, I don't feel that confident in that, but I feel like medium confident. You know what I'm saying? Right. I'm just like, wait, 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 wait. So literally, the game count is at the bottom, though, so we definitely messed up. Yeah. Well, Not see, bad. See, here's the benefit. You know, here's the benefit. Here's the benefit. I don't care. Like, Twitch chat loves you and hates me, so they're just going to blame me for it. It's fine. I don't think they love me. I love, me. I love them. Good job. I love that by Wizzy. That was he, a he, great pickup. He faded like he was going to back air 100%. Mars believed him. He yep. got forward smashed. Wow, he just death smashed his partner. No. No, him and Light, like, they play each other a lot, but it can't be that confusing. But, you know, we're mixing up the games. Mars is mixing up his partner. You know, if he had went, blue, if he'd went blue Fox, this wouldn't yes, happen. Yes, this is all his, Light's <laughs> fault. I forgot. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Anyway, that's going to be doubles right there. Uh, I hope Nairo and Dark Wizzy don't spend their $35 in one place. <laughs> Oh, nice. That was sick, actually. I actually love Nairo's Palu. I think everyone does, though. Yeah, honestly. Anyway, so I think, honestly, on the I game think, three here. I think I think Nairo could just play Bayo in like, Smash 4, and people would still love Nairo. Uh, that, honestly, you might have actually just hit the line. Like, that might have just been it. You think so? Definitely. See, I think there's actually a lot of benefit to certain characters playing certain players and why people haven't gotten, like, annoyed with Snake already yet. It's because MVD's playing him. I think everyone's annoyed with Snake. I don't, I don't think so. I think because MVD's playing him, he's got a little bit more leeway. I give it six more months in Salem just dominating everything, and everyone's going to be like, all right, this character's dumb. He's so good, dude. He's I, nasty. I, like, I like that character a lot. Well, I, I hate fighting against him, but A, he's cool, and B, yeah. <laughs> well, doubles is over, apparently. Well, then. I thought we 